Hi everyone, welcome back. Remember right before Thanksgiving, we celebrated the Feast of Christ the King? Now, I always announce this feast, and I tack on that it's the end of our liturgical year. It's a big celebration, and here at Our Lady of Peace, we have a procession with the Blessed Sacrament, Adoration, and Benediction. Then, following week, we start the new liturgical year. The first of which, of course, is Advent. We come into church and all of a sudden everything is plain. The Advent wreath is there and things are very subdued. Advent is the first important season of the liturgical year. And Pope Francis said something during his first Sunday of Advent Mass at St. Peter's Basilica in the year 2020. He said, Advent is confidently waiting for the Lord, allows us to find comfort and courage in the dark moment of our lives. Advent is a continuous call to hope. The Holy Father also said that it reminds us that God is present in history to lead it to its ultimate goal and to its fullness, which is the Lord Jesus Christ. Let's talk about the dark moments of our lives. Now, these dark moments have been much more, especially over the past two years. So just a couple days ago, another person I knew passed away from complications of COVID-19. It just keeps going and going and going. New variant this, new procedure that, when will it end? I don't have the slightest idea. It's ridiculous. Now, this is where hope comes in. We all need hope. It gives us something to look forward to, especially in those dark times. But we need to remember that not everyone has the same feelings about hope. For some, there is less hope in their hearts and in their minds. And you know what? That's okay. It takes you and I, other people, to come work together and to bring those that don't have that same sense of hope that we may have, give them a renewed hope. Hope in life, hope in Christ, hope for the world. Jesus never said it was going to be easy. If everything was easy, we would have nothing to work towards. We would just float along day by day, day by day, nothing special. So despite what is going on in our world right now, how can you, we, together, continue to bring hope and build the kingdom to those who need it the most, especially this Christmas season. Let us pray. Loving and ever faithful God, you gave us your only son, Jesus Christ, born of Mary in Bethlehem of Judea in a lowly stable as the star was seen from afar. Ever peaceful was the baby Jesus as shepherds and magi followed the star to worship a newborn king. Together this Advent season, let us embrace joy, strengthen others, seek God's face, and choose peace. Peace in our hearts, our homes, our country, and our world. We ask this in your name. Amen. Have a beautiful day, and we'll see you tomorrow, everyone.